Hello there Star Wars fans and welcome back to another RebelScum.com video review and today's review is sponsored by our good friends over at Gentle Giant who sent us this lovely Han Solo bus to a, for us to review and this is based off of Han's first outfit in Solo's Star Wars story where we see him stealing the well some people like to call it the hard drive some people like to call it the book uh, but he's stealing the uh, airspeeder on Corellia. And this this was a really cool outfit, I thought, for Han. Um, I mean, dude loves vests. What can I say? He's, he's always in, like, a jacket or a vest. I, I get it. You know, you gotta accessorize. Um, anyway, uh, this is the one where he's in the white vest, and what's also really cool is on the box it showcases him holding the dice, and I love that. I love that he's got the dice. Now, this bust is still available to order on Gentle Giant's website, so just go to GentleGiantLTD.com and order yourself a Han Solo bust if this is a bust that you just absolutely have to have, which I recommend because this one looks really, really cool. I mean, a lot of their busts look really, really cool, but this one looks really cool. I'm a big fan of Solo Star Wars Story. Um, like a lot of fans leading up to that movie, I did not have high expectations for it. Um, and it ended up surprising me being a very, very fun and entertaining Star Wars film. So I really like Solo. It's a special place in my heart. Um, and I, I think they captured the essence of that young, impetuous Han Solo quite well with this mini bus. Of course, on the back, you've got this awesome uh, shot of Alden in in costume and that's pretty much it for the box let's let's take a look at the bus now oh um and in case i didn't mention i believe he's about 120 dollars on gentle giants website if you want to order him there and he is all wrapped up here you don't see the oh the dice are a separate piece that's really cool neat Oh yeah, yeah, I like that. That's really that's really awesome looking. I like how he's just kind of like holding out his hand, um, like it, it's it's kind of close to to the scene where he's about to put him up on what on the rearview mirror, you know. Um, oh, these dice are really tiny. You gotta be really careful not to lose these. Let's see. Yeah, those are so small. And uh, they've got little chain goods. That chain is so, so small. But they did mold the individual symbols on the dice. That's pretty cool. All right, guys, just so you can see how absolutely small these are. I mean, I'm zoomed in as far as I can possibly go. And I don't know if the camera's going to pick up the little symbols. I don't know if it's going to. It's definitely not if it's gonna try and focus on my ring. Um, stop shaking. <laughs> stop, or swinging, rather. Stop it. There we go. Yeah, I don't know if y'all are able to see those tiny symbols. They are so, so small. But anyway, we're gonna we're gonna go ahead and loop them on his hand. So it just, just like the box suggests, I mean, you just kind of drape it over his finger here, his index finger. Um, I mean, the, the, the box shows it a little, little further forward on the hand. I kind of like to have it over here on this uh, little knuckle here because then it has both dice kind of facing, facing forward, rather one being in front of the other. And it's further back on the hand. So if it starts to slip, it might catch in between those two fingers. So just in case something happens, you know, a cat or something gets on the shelf, if you have these displayed in a place with cats, I've got cats. Um, now I don't display busts where cats can get to them, but still, I mean, just in case, you know, you have something, uh, something happens with your shelf, something bumps into your shelf, you know, I would be worried about losing that tiny, tiny accessory, um, because those, those dice are really, really cool. Hey, you got a little fuzz in your hair, buddy. Here, I got you. 
There you go. All, all better. Um, yeah. But I, I really love that they included the dice, and I also like that they made them a separate accessory in this case. I mean, yes, the, the downside to them being a separate accessory is they're easier to lose, but the upside is you can put them in a different spot on his hand. You can display them in a separate way. You can set them in his pouch over here, which is just kind of open there on his side pocket. I mean, you can't really see them there, but um, if you like to keep all of your accessories together with your bust or as many of your accessories as possible, then you're less likely to lose it. But I, I really like the dice. I, I especially like the dice a lot because the fact that they made them so small and still got the symbols on the, on the faces of the dice are really cool. Now, aside from that, I mean, the face sculpt looks really nice. Um, yeah, it's not a bad face sculpt. They, they, you know, they even got his five o'clock shadow going on there. Um, you, the, I like the little dings and scratches and uh, scrapes on his leather vest there. You can, you can feel the different textures on his sleeves. He's got the driving gloves because, of course, Han has driving gloves, right? And all in all, just a really, really awesome mini bust. If, if you really like Han Solo or you liked Solo Star Wars Story, I definitely recommend picking this one up. But yeah, like I said, overall, a pretty awesome bust from a pretty awesome movie. I mean, who would have thought that Solo was going to be awesome? Not a lot of people at first, but it ended up being pretty awesome. And like I said, go to General Giant, order this guy. He's really, really cool looking. Um, another awesome Han. And again, the, the dice just really make this thing awesomely unique as a, as a piece. There's not a lot of... Uh, Han Solo busts out there that include his dice and that that really makes this one stick out in my opinion so there you go guys thank you so much for tuning in today make sure you like and subscribe follow us on social media and make sure you go to rebelscum.com every single day because there's always something new posted on rebelscum.com follow us on social media and go to rebelscumshop.com for all kinds of awesome swag and merch like the shirt I'm wearing right now. This one is available to order right this second. So go order this shirt if you really like it. We'll see you guys later. We'll see you another time. May the force be with all of you, you rebel scum.